hey girl hey welcome back to my channel we are starting off this vlog it's friday afternoon it's a beautiful day in february i wanted to share my outfit for you guys because we're about to head out i'm going with my mom to a design meeting we're picking out faucets and potentially windows so i figured it'd be a fun a little field trip sometimes i pop in on these meetings i've talked about on the podcast before but they're very interesting so i am tagging along today with the entire design team and it is quite an honor so anyway this is what i'm wearing i just filmed a little tickety talk to share with you guys over there but i figured let's do it on youtube as well this oxford is from j crew i actually got it for christmas and what i love about it is that it has my monogram on the cuff my initials j crew makes it really easy to personalize your white oxfords I got this for Christmas. My jacket is from Urban Revivo. It's actually brand new. It's this pink lady jacket. It comes in a couple different colors. Perfect for spring. I'm trying to wear more color. I feel like it really just brightened up the whole look. And it was easy because I paired everything with basics and then I just like threw this fun jacket on and it made the whole outfit really come together. I'm wearing my J. Crew pixie pants mostly because they're the most comfortable. And I feel like when I have a heavy top, I like to have a tighter bottom. And they feel like you're wearing leggings, but it's like a nice work pant. And then I'm wearing the brown penny loafers as per usual because they're a pretty substantial loafer. And also my mom's wearing black loafers and I didn't want to be like crazy matching with my, her because she picked her outfit first. Then I'm taking my Gucci purse. I just switched out the brown leather strap to go with the penny loafers. I'm wearing my hair back because I'm going to get a blowout tomorrow for the gala that I'm going to, gala. And then I just have necklace, regular rings, and yeah. This is the full look. So I'm going to grab a jacket. We're going to head to the meeting. I'll talk to you guys in the car, but I'm so excited to get this weekend vlog started. Subscribe if you are new here and let's have ourselves a fabulous weekend, everyone. We're picking out faucets for the bathrooms and then we just picked out the kitchen faucet and the bar faucet as well. So many different options, but we're narrowing it down. and welcome back to the vlog it is currently saturday evening and i'm about to head out for a night of festivities i'm going to the jump back ball which is in cleveland it is at playhouse square it's a big fundraiser so i'm staying over at claire and connor's tonight i'm going with my friend aubrey claire and connor and then we're going to meet some other people there i got my hair done earlier today with so i have my bag packed for the evening and i'm wearing this brand new dress which is from alice and olivia if you follow me on instagram i did take pictures before this in the polka dot um gown that was my mom's prom dress if you follow me on TikTok or Instagram, I was asking people suggestions. I ended up ordering this dress this week and it came, so I am wearing this because it's honestly just better for the function because we're going out afterwards and so I can't be in like a gown, but I still wanted to take pictures, so <laughs> I'm not, I'm kind of fibbing, but who doesn't love a good photo shoot really at the end of the day? It just comes down to having photo shoots and dressing up. So this is what I'm wearing. It's this brand new dress from Alice and Olivia. So this is the dress. I think it's so fun. It's actually the same style as my rehearsal dinner dress um just with like this full skirt and this sheer sleeve i just personally think this is really flattering on me i'm wearing sheer tights and i literally have loafers on right now because i didn't want to like wear my heels quite yet and waste my feet these earrings are from magan gavigan they're these beautiful um like iridescent lavender drop down earrings they actually sent them to me gorgeous i've only worn them once in palm beach and i was like wait a minute this dress has like purple in it and then don't mind my hands i'm wearing my tiffany pearl hermes and then just a little band cleef and then i doubled up my ysl for a little shoulder bag and then i'm just gonna wear my sarah flint heels and i have my huge bag packed it is so heavy for tonight i actually just got this purse in the mail it's from barrington gifts i knew i was getting it but such perfect timing this is like their huge travel bag i think it's called the saint Anne. i'm working with them but i literally couldn't even wait to use it it's in this new pattern and it has my initials on it so i just stuffed everything in there i brought makeup toiletries pajamas and then an outfit for tomorrow and like i put my heels my coat and stuff in there so I'm going to go pick my friend Aubrey up, then we're going to go to my sister's apartment, and then I think we're going to have drinks there, and then the event starts at 8. 
and then we're gonna go out club another club no sleep but I'm just gonna be vlogging on my phone for the rest of the evening so I will pull that back out but I am gonna bring my camera I'm just gonna leave it in like my travel bag so let's get this night started since the last clip. It's actually Wednesday. I hope you guys enjoyed that portion of the video. It was a really fun weekend um, and I tried to share as much as possible. But for the end of this video, I thought it'd be fun to do a, another styling fashion segment all about spring break because it's, for me, March 1st when I'm filming this, which is why I put my green on. I wanted to be in spring colors. I feel like green is just the color of March. And also spring break is probably coming up for a bunch of you guys. So I wanted to get this video out and share some of the items. And I'm super excited about these pieces, particularly because they all are very affordable and reasonable prices. So we're not breaking the bank for spring break, but we have super cute items that my mom and I have shopped together and kind of rounded up and I have presented it here it's like a presentation that I'm sharing with you guys like I went out and found everything and then I'm sharing my final product but spring break is a really fun time of year it's a good refresh for everyone whether you're in high school or college or you're taking an adult spring break I'm crashing my sister's spring break we're going to Palm Springs California which I've never been to before so all these items kind of had Palm Springs in mind but I feel like they can be applied to any spring break vacation. Last year we went to Charleston and that was really fun. I love dressing on theme with the place that I'm going to. So before we begin, I just wanted to share where my outfit's from. So you still need something good for St. Patrick's Day. I picked up this green sweater from J. Crew. After my pop-up shop, they usually give me a credit so I can pick out a few items. And I thought that this basic green sweater is not only a classic, but it will also be great for St. Patrick's Day. I'm wearing white pants from J. Crew, my brown penny loafers, and then I decided to just throw a belt on to kind of tuck the sweater in a little bit. So super simple outfit, but bringing in those spring colors. So I'm gonna start off with the shoes that we have found. Keep in mind that these items are for both Elizabeth and myself. I'm just showing them to you all in one fell swoop. Okay, so we did a lot of shopping at Dillard. So the first pair of flats are from Antonio Milani. It's one of our favorites that Dillard's sells. So they are these adorable rattan pointy flats, a backless loafer, and then I love the coral detailing on the top. I feel like this would actually look great with what I'm wearing, like a pair of wide leg white pants and these little backless loafers. And this is also going to take you right into spring if you guys go into an office and you just want a little shoe refresh. I thought these were the perfect spring and summer shoe. So I will link these down below and I can also do a little try on portion if you guys want to see what they look like on. Okay next from Target if you guys need a good heel for spring break we found these from the brand A New Day which is like Target's um sorry there's a train going which is Target's classic line that they always hold but I thought these were really cute I like the detailing on the straps and they're just nude I think the nude shoe will go with everything so if you just want a good pair of heels that you don't have to worry about for your trip I would definitely recommend these and they're gonna go with everything another pair of sandals from Target also from the brand a new day are these adorable rattan slide on sandals these are gonna be my go-to shoes for this spring and summer they are gonna be perfect for Palm Springs but also just the whole entire summer a woven sandal can seriously go with every single outfit so I thought that this was a really great find and I knew that you guys would 
particularly like these. A little bit more expensive of a heel also from Antonio Milani are these stunning rattan heels. I love how they are open in the back and then the detailing on the front to me is just so interesting and sophisticated. I think these are going to be so fun on spring break and again all of these things can easily carry you into the summer so you're not just buying for one trip. I think in some ways you're just working ahead for summer because a lot of great things are out right now because a lot of stores are gearing up for spring break so definitely keep in mind what you can wear on your trip but then also take throughout the entire summer. So these are super cute. Next are another pair of heels from Target. As you can see, the detailing on the straps are just super neutral. I think these might be my favorite shoes out of all of them. They are also from Antonio Milani. They're so different and fun for us, but yet kind of still on brand because I'm a sucker for anything gingham. So that's exactly what this is. And it's like a chunky heel. I thought these were so fun. It's gonna be perfect for Palm Springs and then also just the rest of the summer. Another perfect i think i posted about these on my instagram like if you need the perfect spring summer shoe i would say that this is going to be the best bet out of everything that i've shared so these flats are from antonio milani and i just think they're so classic and you can wear them for spring but then also right into summer i feel like even if you had like a casual work setting you could maybe also wear these to work maybe i'm not quite sure but a pointed toe kind of like a woven feeling I would say is the material and I like how you can kind of see through it I think that's super cute and then it has this adorable tie in the back this is gonna look great with dresses jeans the pants that I have on right now pretty much any outfit and I also think that they're just a little different than other shoes that I've been seeing recently so I would say if you want one spring slash summer shoe, I would totally go with these flats. Next from Walmart, we found these fabulous espadrilles. This is the perfect shoe for spring break because you don't have to worry about them. Again, you can kind of like wear them out, let them get beat up a little bit, but they're super cute and basic. They never go out of style. So I was really excited when my mom and I found a pair like this on Walmart. And then we also got it in a black pair. They look pretty much the same. They're just in black. So you guys can have options. And honestly, they feel they do have a little zipper in the back and they feel like they're made pretty nicely, I will say for Walmart. So definitely give it a try. I think these are also Walmart. We saw these we saw these somewhere. And they are these little slide-ons. I just thought this would be cute for Palm Springs to throw on by the pool. I thought the gold detailing in the front was super cute or even with just like a little athleisure outfit, something simple like that, like a cozy poolside look would be perfect with these. And then the last shoe that we have, these are Sam Edelman. So these are gonna be a little nicer made. They're probably gonna hold up much, much longer than the other shoes I showed you. It's mixing in that woven rattan look with these adorable pearls. So kind of a neutral in a way. I feel like pearls can in some ways be a neutral because this is gonna go with at least every single one of my outfits. So that was the shoe portion of this video. And now I'm gonna move on to the clothing. As always, everything will be linked down below. So the first thing we picked up is this beautiful skirt from Antonio Milani. This totally looked like Palm Springs to us. So that's why we personally picked it up. I actually think this might be for my mom. Next we have this dress, which I'm pretty sure is from Target because it was only like $35. I thought this was also really cute with any, literally any of the shoes that I shared for like a dinner look. And then it could pair perfectly with one of these straw bags. This one's from Target. It's the brand A New Day. And like, look how cute that is just with a pair of the espadrilles from Walmart. I thought that it was perfect. Also from Target is this really cute orange dress. This would be perfect for like a shopping day. I would probably pair it with the rattan sandals from Target. So this is like a full Target look. Pair it with this purse, which is also from Target. We thought this was so cute because it was like a shoulder bag, but a straw shoulder bag and then I also like this strap I think this is still available because we recently just got it so this is a super cute look next from Walmart this is such a good find is this one shoulder green dress which is kind of like a midi I don't think that it hits all the way down to your feet but it kind of hits around that ankle level and then it has a big strap to tie a bow and I just think this is so fabulous and it's literally from Walmart it could go with the espadrilles or any of the shoes that I shared. And then we also have this really, really cute other straw purse that we found. And this has a strap or it could be more of a delicate handbag. So this for a dinner look is not only dramatic, but affordable, which is exactly what we want. So I thought this was a really great find. And again, I can try this on so you guys can see how this looks. 
And then we also purchased it in the black because it was just such a great style that we figured getting it in a fun color and then a basic color is like a good way to go. Next from Antonio Milani is this gorgeous white dress with these really fun sleeves. I like that they're shorter, but they're still a puff sleeve. And then it has this really cool bow on the front. I think this is super chic and very dramatic. And this could also be perfect for like a summer event. So you don't have to just limit it to your spring break. I'm really excited and interested to see what this looks like on. Okay, next we just picked up a basic short sleeve top from Target. I actually really like this like taupe color. I feel like it's actually going to go with a lot more things than I think, like even a pair of jeans or these white pants for during the day. And the sun hat would be adorable. Next is this set from Antonio Milani. Look at how adorable this is. So it's a matching pant and top look with shells all over it. I don't know how much cuter you can get. What's also great about this is you can wear these pieces separately so you're getting more outfits for one, you could pair this with a pair of white pants and then you could just do like a blouse or a little sleeveless top I think would also be cute. So it could be day to night. And I just thought this was really clever and different. You know, it's, it's fresh. Another set, I think this might be my favorite set, are these pink pants, which look very flowy and comfortable. And then this matching top. And I love this scallop across the front. And then it kind of goes like into the back. It almost looks like a little bib in the back, but it's really cute. This is also Antonio Milani, like I said, Dillard's is kind of making a comeback single-handedly by Antonio Milani. Like, we found some great pieces in the fall, and then again with this spring line, I don't know why, I just feel like it's happy and youthful and interesting, so very excited to wear this in Palm Springs. I have another set, except this is actually from Walmart, so it's nice because you can see the higher end, more expensive options, but then you can also see that this can easily be recreated very affordably. So it's this adorable like knit dress and I love this baby blue I think it's really cute and then it comes with this matching cardigan that you can either kind of wear on top like an actual sweater or I thought it'd be cute draped over your shoulders so this would also be great for Easter or like a baby shower or really any spring event I thought it was really cute also from Walmart is this very delicate feminine little spring top you can either take this on a spring break or just save it like if you're in college and you need some more spring tops for going out. I thought this would be super cute or even just like post-college. I thought this was very sweet. kind of has that like smocked feel to it and a longer sleeve. I also feel like this square neck is super flattering on people. And again, it's Walmart. Okay, this is either Target or Walmart, but just an easy button down for a pool cover up or for the beach. I love just throwing these over. I think they're so effortless and cool. Um, so it's always nice to pick another one up before a trip because it's just fun to have like fresh cover ups and bathing suits and stuff like that. Okay. We did have to throw some J crew into here because it wouldn't be a haul if J crew like wasn't mentioned. So look at this adorable bathing suit that we got. It is a long sleeve rash guard, which I personally think is so flattering on people. Like I don't think we talk about rash guards enough. I love them because it like sucks you in. It makes you feel so confident, but you also look like sporty in a way, which is like kind of to me equals being chic. I don't know. It makes sense in my head. Um, and you guys know we love matching stuff. I love that it's a bright color because I have a black rash guard that I wore in the Hamptons, which was really cool, but it's like stupid expensive. This is J. Crew, so it is going to be expensive, but not like out of control. And then we also got a matching sarong. I mean, look how just precious this is. I'm in love with it. It's so good. And then we also just picked up another classic J. Crew pink one shoulder bathing suit. We have a lot of these. They are great every year. Like we just kind of restock with another color every year because one of us will wear it. Okay, next are two more really fun bathing suits. I think these are from Walmart, but I'm getting them confused with like the Target tag. Again, it'll be linked down below. I love this one piece because it's ribbed and it kind of has like a little bit more texture. I think this green is really in. And then we just decided to pick up a purple one as well because these are colors that I feel like we don't typically wear, but like it's, it's fun in a bathing suit. We personally like one pieces. So a lot of these are one pieces. Next, we have another bathing suit in that same pattern as the shell set. So this is also Antonio Milani. I thought this was super retro and it's going to be perfect for Palm Springs. The back you can just tie and then it has straps that you can also attach, which is super cute. For some reason we have this bottom, but I'm not seeing a top to it. So 
I don't really know what that's doing here. And then last but certainly not least, this is the showstopper of bathing suits. We saw this on, I think this is also Dillard's. Yeah, this is the Antonio Milani. So it's this green one piece, which obviously green has been super in. I feel like it's a really great color on everybody. Like no matter what hair color you have, I feel like green looks good on people. And then it has this beautiful like pearl detailing on the front. And then this top, which literally looks like a cardigan. It has buttons down the front with the same pearl detailing, except it's the top to the two piece and it looks like a sweater. And then you could also wear it on top of this one piece. So you're getting three looks in one. I've never seen anything like this, like a cardigan with a bathing suit. Are you kidding me? That is the cutest thing ever. So this unsnaps or actually unbuttons in the front and then goes on top of this. And then again, we just got this adorable shoulder bag from Target, super cute. If you want something a little bigger, um, I would recommend this. This is from Target, so the first one's also from Target. And then the last one is a good combo of both because you can wear it over your shoulder and then you can carry it around at night. And this one is from, where is she from? Oh, she's from J. Crew. you know what? She looked like she was from J. Crew. She looked like she was made a little bit better than the other ones. So I'm going to try some of this stuff on. It might be super overexposed, but it's like a really sunny day and I have windows coming at me. So I put on this orange dress, which is the Target look. I just think it's so cute. It fits like a glove. And again, I think pairing it with this purse in particular. And then I threw on my Sam, the Sam Edelman shoes with the pearls. So yeah, she's just so fun for brunch or shopping around. I thought that this would be perfect. Okay. Um, we have another dress. I put on the Antonio Milani white dress. I think it's really pretty. It's different, which I like. I feel like this gives us something more than what I've been seeing. And it does fit, which is cool. And then this little bow on the front. And it's actually really pretty, like, neckline. And then it has this cool detailing. I think it would look great with the Walmart black espadrilles. I don't know if I would necessarily wear, wear a tan purse. I might do one of, like, my designer handbags just to like elevate this a little bit but I definitely think it's really pretty and chic so I'm thinking maybe these would go or you could also do these to make it no I don't like that so I'm thinking I would probably wear oh my gosh it would even be cute if I wore like my Chanel ballet flats like something so fun like that and like a big pair of black sunglasses I think that could also be super classic but yeah definitely check this out if you need like even if you're a bride and you have bridal things coming up I think that this would be a really fun spin because you're still in a white gown but this hint of black gives it a little bit more depth to me it just makes it a little bit more intriguing so this is the green dress from Walmart that we also got in black so I just wanted to put one of them on for sizing so you can see it is honestly so cute and it fits and it's so spring break and kind of dramatic. I probably do like the bigger clutch, but maybe if you're with friends, like do a smaller one, like the J. Crew one would be a great option as well. Um, but yeah, I think this is a 10 out of 10. Like this is so cute. Don't mind my tan, it's like coming off from the other day. Okay, I just put the shell set on and oh my gosh, I am obsessed. I'm really hoping you guys can see it's so hard to film because in like this room because I feel like there's no room but I think you can see the pants look how cute they fit perfectly like they fit perfectly and then the top is so darling with these big sleeves I just think it's perfection and it would go with a number of the shoes that I shared and I would probably take I could not get this back on there we go I'd probably take this little purse just because it's so precious look how cute this is for dinner or something I'm obsessed with it okay but look how cute we are is this not like retro Palm Springs I feel like I'm going to match my hotel it also is kind of giving Palm Beach this is the cutest set ever it's actually sleeveless which I didn't realize and then this like scalloped bib part goes straight across and then you can see the back is also just I love the detailing obviously the tag is still on I would definitely take this little purse and then this is what the pants look like I feel like these sets are low-key so flattering on me for some reason I don't know and then I could also just wear this top with a pair of white pants so it's another outfit these sets are really giving you two outfits in one and again I would probably take this little purse like I said this is by far my favorite like if you're shopping <gasps> look how cute this is you guys 
Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. I did put on the little top, so adorable. This is from Walmart. Once again, it fits perfectly. I just threw back on my white pants I had on before. I'd probably wear like a tighter white pant or even jeans, but I just think this is so sweet and feminine and girly. And yeah, you can take it on spring break, but it's also just like the perfect spring top. We have the little Walmart dress, which is so cute. I just put it on. This blue color is precious. And then I would probably, someone just texted me, I would probably just throw the sweater over top because I think it looks the best, especially if you're going to be in a warmer climate. But you could also just, like, obviously, you know, put it on. But yes, or you could even kind of just, like, throw it over your shoulder like this. I also thought this would be cute for Easter. And the best part is that it's at a great price from Walmart. Okay, everyone, so that was all of the items that I wanted to share. I hope you guys enjoyed this styling video and that you're all getting excited for spring break. Or if you're not going on spring break, just spring weather in general. Because today, as you can probably tell from how bright it was in this room, is a gorgeous day out. So the setting was so fitting for my little styling video. Um, but once again, if you need a green sweater for St. Patrick's Day, highly recommend this. It's a great fit. And then you can also just wear it like throughout the rest of the year and into the summer as always everything will be linked down below if you would like me to do any other type of styling segments I know we did a whole like workwear segment in the past few vlogs and then I wanted to start talking about the springtime because it's coming ladies we have to be prepared also if you are not subscribed to my youtube channel please subscribe it really helps me out and if you're already watching my videos it's just one click away um and I would be so grateful so until next time I will see you all in my next video I hope you enjoyed this and I will talk to you later bye everyone